A man is dead in Hampton after investigators say he attempted to attack his ex-girlfriend early this morning. Police say she is okay. Another man is also expected to recover. This all happened on Winder Court. Kiana Patterson has been covering this story all day. Kiana, tell us what more happened here. Well, police have been here all day long, Regina. They just wrapped up that investigation about an hour ago. We saw detectives take several bags of evidence from this house, and we talked with some neighbors here on Winter Court. They tell us that their neighbors lived here for several years, and they are so happy that she is okay. Now, Hampton police were called here. This is just off of Big Bethel Road around 5 this morning. We're told an ex-boyfriend attacked the couple while they were inside getting ready for the day. The couple was stabbed several times during the fight inside. Now, police have confirmed that a man was hit in the head and he died here at the scene. Lincoln Santiago is the woman's dad, and she says her ex is a convicted felon with an abusive and violent past. He adds that he, he attacked her earlier this year, stabbing her then. Three or four months ago, he stabbed her a few times, and, and, and she fought and got away. She had some uh, some wounds, and she recovered. And, and he actually had been texting her and calling her recently, like as recent as last week, telling her he was coming. And Santiago did confirm the person's name, but police have not confirmed that name to us just yet. They say they have to notify his family before that information is released. But coming up at 5 o'clock, Santiago explains how her new boyfriend saved her life. Here in Hampton, Kiana Patterson, turn on your side.